Ravens like, look, y'all, we getting rid of everybody this offseason. We don't care how y'all feel about them. They are out. The Ravens, they selected in the fourth round, punter, Penn State, because, you, you know, EDC, he got them ties with Penn State. I think, uh, like, so one of his kids, I think, yeah, their daughter goes to Penn State. Um, but Penn State's punter, Jordan Stout. So, um, you got to feel like that's the end, end for Sam Cook. I mean, it, it's, it's, it's got to be. If, they, if they're selecting a punter this high, I mean, they got like a million fourth round picks, and then I think what well, they got like one in the six, I think. But if they're selecting a punter this high, then that's, that, that's it for Sam Cook. Shout out to Brian McFarlane, who broke the math down already. He said releasing Sam Cook will create 2.1 million salary cap space. Um, and if they went decided to go with Stout, then his cap number would only be 879,000. So the savings would be 1.2 mil. So, yeah, it's, it's going down. Um, it's not obviously not official that they released Sam Cook yet, but you got to figure, like, it's on the way. Um, I know a lot of people uh, were wondering why they didn't draft um, uh, a razor. But I, I see that um, Matt Miller at NFL Draft Scout, he said uh, most teams actually have Stout as the higher rated punter uh, because he's right footed and a razor is left footed. So if it was a kicker, then I could understand that. But as far as a punter, I guess maybe teams are cert used to cert setting up the special teams a certain way when it comes to punt. I, I don't know. So I I'm not sure what the big difference is, and, and I, I, I'm naive to what the big difference is between a left-footed punter and a right-footed punter. Like, with a left-footed kicker and a right-footed, okay, I get that, but a left and, and right punter, I, I'm not sure what the big difference is because they're both, like, 10, 15 yards behind the line, uh, behind the line of scrimmage when the long snapper snaps the ball to him. So I'm not... It's not like they're like right up under the center or anything like, or right up under the long snap when he's snapping the ball to him. No, they they a little ways back. So I'm not sure what the big difference would be between somebody being left and right footed. But hey, if, if y'all know, please let me know in the comment section because, like I said, I am naive to what the difference would be. I, I don't, I just don't know. Um, but yeah, this this pretty much spells the end, in my opinion, in my opinion. But it spells the end of Sam Cook. Um, so we got to see, let's, let's see how it goes. Uh, so anyway, appreciate y'all love y'all. And like Sam cook is probably going to be like, this is a fourth round pick. Like if it was like a, a sixth round or a seventh round pick, then maybe I, I will say, Oh, maybe they may put him on a practice squad, but a fourth round pick at punt. Like you picked a punter very high. You picked a punter very, very high. That's why this lets me know, like for sure that Sam cook, that he's gone. So, Sam Cook been around with the Ravens for a long, oh, a long time, a long time. So it'll be weird, man. So they, it's like they're breaking up the Wolf Pack slowly and slowly. First they took they 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 released uh, Morgan Cox a couple years ago, um, and now Sam Cook could be up next. But we'll see, we'll see. Nothing set in stone, but with a fourth round pick on the punter, yeah, it, it's probably set.